What's going on, my little piglets? It's your BFF Pork Chop here, and I'm coming at you with Christopher yep. to do the Chopping Birds NFL Pick'em Week Three. Three. Chopping Birds. Chopping Birds. Okay, Three. so the record so far as of Week Two ending, cool. I'm 15 and seven, and I am 14 and 18. I took the crown back. The crown's mine again. Well, not again. This is the first time I've had it this year. I was like, it's, it's so, going to go back and forth probably. So we are below 500. So we are technically the uh, Fisher, <laughs> the Coach Fisher uh, of the NF, of the uh, Pick'em. So terrible. without further ado, before we get started, hit that subscribe button. It's over there in the top right corner, as well as turn notifications on right below where the subscribe button is I to can, be notified every time we no post a Pick'em. I can notify. He can notify. <laughs> he gets notified. He's part of the notification squad. Hashtag notification squad. So without further ado, let's do this, Christopher. What are the games for week yeah, three? We got Thursday night. We got the Texans at the now third string Patriots. See, that's why I'm going to pick the Texans because of the third string situation. I almost want to pick the Patriots because I really, I mean, Belichick. Belichick. Uh, I'm a, but when you, you got. Know, when, I ain't got no money on this league, so I'm going to pick the Patriots. You got to pick the Patriots. All right. At so, home. like, the. When your wide receiver is your backup quarterback, that might be an issue if yeah, something goes wrong. Just a little bit. But, so, we picked differently. And it didn't even take to the second pick. We did the first pick. That's so. right. We acquired quite, quite a few different ones. Uh, quite a few. There, there, starting off Sunday, we have the Raiders at my Tennessee. My 1-0. One 1-1 oh, one, one one Tennessee Titans. I like the matchup for Tennessee. So, I think I'm going to pick Tennessee this week. <gasps> yeah. I like the matchup. I'm picking Tennessee as well. We, like we, we, we pretty much ran over the Raiders in the preseason. So, <laughs> in, the, in game three. So, pretty excited about yeah. that. So, the Raiders are... Are not who we thought they were. They're not who we thought they were. Titans are potentially two and one. I yeah, love that'd, it. That'd be nice. It would be really, nice. really nice start to the season. Both, high five, Colin. Both of our teams won. Yes. Cardinals at the Bills. I'm gonna pick the Cardinals. The Bills are a dumpster fire right now. Well, no, the Bills are like <laughs> having an identity, identity crisis. Yeah, <laughs> they fired their. Well, they fired their offensive coordinator. No defensive coordinator. No, no, no. That's Rob Ryan. Rob, Rob Ryan's a. They fired the offense. Offensive coordinator, which yeah. is not a good thing. That's, that's already. That's already. Not they're, a good they're already thing. scared. All right, so. I'm so I'm gonna go with the Cardinals as well. The Cards. Oh my. It's in the cards. This is. Oh. Toss up. Toss up. Bah. We got the Browns and the Dolphins. I because I have the defense for the Dolphins in my DraftKings this weekend. I'm gonna go with the Dolphins. I'm surprised how much the spread is. What's the spread? Dolphin. The Dolphins are a nine and a half point favorite. All right, let's go Dolphins. I'm going to go Dolphins. Go Dolphins. because I, I guess because the Browns do have a third string quarterback now. Pretty much. Poor guy. Yeah. <laughs> They've had a different quarterback for each week so far. So this will be interesting. So because of the third string quarterback, just like the New England, I'm, I'm going to pick the Dolphins. Browns are. I'm going to pick the. Yeah, nothing. Uh, we got the uh, toss up. We got the Ravens and the Jags. Jags. This brother's even. No, I'm going to pick Baltimore. I'm going to go with Jags at home. I'm going to pick Baltimore. Disappoint me last week, Jags. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> but Baltimore is probably a good win. Here we go. And we got the Lions at the Packers. I'm going to pick the Packers. I'm going to pick the Packers. Because Aaron Rodgers, I don't think, can lose two games in a row. I still, I don't have, think it's faith, I still have faith in that team. I don't think it's possible for Aaron Rodgers to lose two games in a row. It's not his DNA. That's right. He has Olivia Munn. He has Olivia Munn. Yeah. Yeah. He's got one of the, he's got X Men for a girlfriend, so. Yeah, there we go. Then we got, uh, I don't know if this is a toss up or not, but it could be. Potential toss up. Uh, we got the Broncos and Bengals. I'm going Bengals. Oh. It's not prime time. It's not prime time. And Simeon hasn't looked great. He's thrown three picks already. He's looked. Uh, the defense has won those two games. Defense wins championships. So but the I'm defense gonna, can't win you sixteen games. I know. I'm sorry. I'm gonna pick Denver in this one. I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick. Yeah, I'm gonna pick Denver. I'm gonna pick the Bengals because the defense can't win you every single game. It's just not gonna happen. The defense will not score you fourteen points every week. I'm no, sorry, they it won't will happen. Von Miller. Can, Von Miller can though. <laughs> Put him on offense. <laughs> Von Miller is like another JJ White. He can score on both sides. Yeah. Defense, offense. He sells popcorn. He can probably kick. No, he, I saw the video. He, he couldn't kick. He valet. He's valet parking. He sells Madden too. He sells Madden. Here we go. Oh, we got the uh, the Vikings and the Panthers. The Panthers woke up last week. They did, and I think they're going to stay awake because there's no AP. And oh no, that's that's tragic. I was impressed by Bradford. Bradford looked, looked good. He looks solid. I picked him up this week in my fantasy league, but he's still a backup. He, 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 I think. I mean, I might get some hate from this from like Eric Harris, somebody. I think he's a better passer than. 
Teddy Bridgewater. Well, I think he is. He's more developed and he's seasoned. Well, yeah, but I think he's a better passer, I think, than Teddy is. Well, yeah, I mean, but Teddy, Teddy can run. Stephon Diggs, though. I mean, when you have Stephon Diggs as one of your wide receivers, you're yeah, going to go off. He did go off. But Stephon Diggs is on my fancy bench. He's on my fancy bench. He is a, Tanner. He's the fourth. He's the fourth of the mic. Was it, the it was team. Andrew that was and, like Andrew's and, like, hey, I'll take him because he's on your bench. But no, <laughs> uh, that's how good my receivers are. Okay, so the next one. Uh, yeah, who did I? Wait, what game was that? That was the. I got. I, I choose the Panthers as well. Vikings. You choose the Vikings. No, I was saying oh, what oh, game oh, you were on. Yes, <laughs> the Ashton Panthers. Okay, no, here we go. No. Uh, more of a. I'm not. I did, I would not pick who I thought I was gonna pick at the beginning of the season. We have the Redskins and Giants. I'm on Giants. I'm on Giants. I'm on the Giants bandwagon, man. They, that, those three receivers are deadly. And when your locker room splits, it's not good for the franchise. And although people, I'm okay with that locker room splitting, because I want to see Colt McCoy. Receivers are pissed at Cousins right now. And I mean, he did throw away like 14 points, and yeah. I threw away the game and the interception. He went to church. He went to church. I think I, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to say this, and Kelly may not agree, but I think. That game was more of a Redskin loss than it was a Cowboy win. Yeah, I agree. I agree with you okay. on that one. I agree yeah, with you on that one. Okay. Um, because like even like during the second quarter, Johnson's like, "Oh, we lost. We lost. We're down by four. We lost." And I was like, "You're probably right because we're gonna find." I mean, in that onside kick, I was like, "Yep, we lost." I mean, Cousins threw away probably either easily fourteen to twenty. And I think there. Cousins is gonna do it again this week. Giants are a way better defense than the Cowboys, yeah, so not, yeah. it might be a pick parade for Mr. Cousins. We're gonna see. I mean, they held they held the New Orleans Saints to a very low scoring game. That's pretty impressive. Here we have got the Rams and the Bucks. Bucks. I'm going the Bucks as well. I'm gonna go Bucks. The uh, Buck stops here. I, I think uh, J, uh, not Jason. Who is that? Who is that? Jameis. Jameis Winston. Famous I, think he, I think he bounces back. And uh, still, LA has yet to score touchdowns since 1994. So. <laughs> That's really sad. There we go. We got the uh, the Niners and the Seahawks. Seahawks, but you know, Russell Wilson looks like he did last week. It might be an interesting game. What the heck's happened to that offense? It's gone. It's gone. It's not there no more. It's terrible now. Apparently, the beast mode was more important than we thought. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so they're like, please come back. Rawls is at hurt. Okay. Michael is a fumbler. Toss it. That's it. We got the Jets at the Chiefs. I'm going Jets. I'm going Jets as well. The Jets. Jets, that defense, though. That defense, though. Chiefs, just, I, mean, I don't know what's wrong with the Chiefs. I mean, they won the first week barely. And then Fitzpatrick was in a freaking gunslinging match last week. He was. That was a fun game to watch. That was a really fun game to watch. Good Thursday night. Slot. Good job. We got the, uh, we got the Chargers at the Colts. I'm going to go Chargers. I'm going to Chargers as well. Go I Chargers. That's pick, terrible for me to say. I thought he was going to pick the Colts. I'm going to Chargers as well. I thought about it all week, and I'm like, nah. Indy's a three-point favorite at home, but I think the Chargers... The, are, uh, Char- Chargers offense is scary at the moment. I don't know why. There's no, it doesn't make no sense. Right, get, get, get this. At one point in the game last week, Phillip Rivers, four touchdowns, five incompletions. Yeah. So I mean, he almost had... And this is without Keenan Allen. Without Keenan. And now that they've lost Danny Woodhead for the season, but I still I still like the advantage yeah. for... Yeah, he's gone. That sucks. Woodhead's gone. That sucks. I didn't know that. Yeah, he's he bye-bye for the season. Well, that's unfortunate. Yes, it is. Good thing you got um, Gordon. Yeah. Either way, let's, now we got the uh, Steelers at the surprisingly pretty good Eagles. I'm still going to go I'm going to go Steelers. I'm still going to go Steelers, too. But the Eagle, Carson Wentz looks good. Carson right? Wentz does look pretty good. He, if Dak does an interception this weekend, which who knows if he will, Carson might Carson might break his record because he hasn't thrown a pick yet either. No, neither Carson nor, 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 nor Dak has. But I, 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 I would say that I like Dak's matchup better this week than Carson's. Oh, yeah. I think, Pitt- I think Carson's going to have his first loss. Yeah. So, But Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh Steelers, Sixburg. I'm picking Sixburg. I'm picking Steelers as well. Here we go. We have the Bears at the Cowboys. Segway. <laughs> Speaking of Dak Prescott, we're both. I think we're both going to pick the Cowboys on this you know one. For the first time this year, I am picking the Cowboys. Welcome to the good side, buddy. <laughs> the Chicago Bears are terrible. Oh my god! Like they. Uh, what was it? Stephen A. Smith said something this week that I actually agreed with. What's that? He said Jay Cutler is the worst quarterback in the NFL. He, I feel like Jake could be so good if he was in the right system. I think Jay Cutler has this, the same problem that David Carr did with the Texans. David Carr had a crappy offense, but he was a good potential quarterback. Yeah. And Cutler has a crappy offensive line. So. You know, Cutler doesn't even care. Yeah, I think it was during 2014, he got paid that $127 
fun $127 million deal, so he doesn't care. He's he make, care. He making money. He has a hurt thumb. He's like, I don't care. I'm still a no, here's, a, here's a toss-up. All right. Which one is yeah, this? The Falcons at Saints in New Orleans. Uh, because it's... Oh, I'm going to pick the Saints. I'm going to pick the Saints, too. I'm going to pick the Saints. We have a lot of the same picks this week. We do, but it, that's okay. That's okay. I think we have a couple that are different. But... There's a few. All right, and that's the last one? That's it. That's, that's Monday that's, Night? That's Monday Night Football. All right, guys. Uh, I'm going to take, po- take a popular consensus here. Do you guys like the audio-only format, or would you guys like to see our beautiful smiling faces, bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, every single uh, Wednesday night, Thursday morning, whenever I get these up, <laughs> because it's like we're supposed to be filming these on Tuesday, and we don't get around to them till Wednesday is when I need to post them. But I usually don't post them. Like last week, I posted at like eleven o'clock at night on Wednesday. So Wednesday night, Thursday morning. So guys, let us know consensus, audio or video. I like audio. I like audio. It's, it's like a like, podcast. It feels like a sports show. Like we're like a sports podcast. Still better than ESPN. I will tell you that. But guys, yeah, up above the right, the right yeah. upper hand corner, there is a subscribe button. Once again, like I said at the beginning of the video, hit that button, as well as hit the notification button down below to get notified every time that Chris and I upload this. Every time I upload a food review, Chris uploads a food review. Every time I upload, you know, any kind of video, Super Mario 64, hint hint, every Monday hashtag PC Mario Monday. So now that I've gotten all that stuff out of the way, so. Guys, thank you all so much once again for dropping by. Send us your picks for a potential shout-out. And always remember my little pig. Let's call him Pork Chop. Loves y'all the, the most. Is. Y'all take it easy, guys. And we will see y'all. I well, not see y'all. You, can, you won't see us, probably. You'll hear us next week. Uh, bye-bye. Bye, guys.